You probably have already heard about intermittent fasting, right? We have mentioned it a few times on our channel. The fact is that intermittent fasting's power and the benefits of good gut bacteria are two of the biggest advances in health research in the past few years. Did you know that? Studies have proved that fasting is good for intestinal health. Then combining these two health trends can really help your body become healthier and even more efficient. Isn't it incredible? Did you know that the intestine is where we have the highest concentration of bacteria in our bodies? The bacteria that inhabit our intestines are called gut microbiota or gut flora. These bacteria play a critical role in preserving the immune function of the mucosa. They also aid in mobility, nutrient absorption, and metabolization of complex carbs and proteins. However, this bacterial concentration may be put at risk by qualitative and quantitative changes, harming metabolic activities. This situation is called dysbiosis and can lead to inflammation and lesions in the mucosa tissue, causing even more health problems like obesity, diabetes, cancer, dementia, and dermatitis. It was noted that the composition of gut microbiota plays an important role in modulating the systemic inflammatory response. For dysbiosis, the recommendation is a low FODMAP diet. Fermentable, oligosaccharides, disaccharides, monosaccharides, and polyols, combined with probiotics, prebiotics, and symbiotics. Talk to a nutritionist to learn more about it. Also, fasting and its effects on the gut microbiota were subject to many studies. Since the diet is one of the main factors of change to the gut microbiota, it isn't hard to conclude that depriving the body of food for extended periods changes the gut composition. According to a research team from the Massachusetts Institute of Technology, MIT, Boston, Fasting for 24 hours helps with the regeneration of intestinal stem cells. The reduction of these cells, essential for regenerating intestinal tissues, leads to a decrease in our ability to recover from intestinal infections and complications, especially as we grow older. Stem cells are immature cells with remarkable properties. For example, they can replicate almost indefinitely and develop inside any type of cell, being essential for the growth and repair of many tissues. In the intestine, Stem cells maintain and repair the tissue lining, which is renewed every five days. Incredible, isn't it? Besides benefiting the intestinal microbiota and protecting the immune system, fasting improves mood, increases metabolism and insulin resistance, helps in fat loss, and aids in muscle construction. How amazing is that? Two things that help maintain a healthy gut microbiota are fasting for 12, 16, or 24 hours, and a diet high in fiber, monounsaturated fats, high-quality proteins, and whole-grain cereals. Interesting, isn't it? If you have ever fasted and benefited from it, share your experience with us. If you have intestinal dysbiosis issues, talk to a doctor or nutritionist. If you liked the video, give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends. For more recipes and tips, subscribe to the channel.